so this is take two. Um, I did talk a lot in my first video, so I always like to record twice to make sure to see which one I like better. So this is the overview. What the hell is that there? Oh, it's my <laughs> it's my pen sting on the screen. So um, this is my Speedy Twenty Five in the monogram. She is my little child. I think she was, yeah, this is my first um, Louis Vuitton piece. I got her for my, in 2018, I don't know how old I was in 2018, so a couple years ago. I think it was for my 21st. I think for my 21st or my 20th, 21st birthday, I think I got her. And she was pre-loved. Um, she was pre-loved, and I'll show you guys what color her vachetta was. Let me just take out my insert, because without the insert, she is the saggiest queen. So, this is the color that the vachetta was. Let me zoom in on that. Before I got her fixed, let's see if you guys could see the color difference. Mm, a little, not too bad, but as you guys could see, this one's way lighter than that. This was not fixed because it's still in amazing condition. But, so, um, I got this bag pre-loved off of eBay from a vintage reseller. And I wore her for like three, four months. And then the chap, no. I first ripped the zipper. I learned this the hard way. You do not open a Speedy from this tab. You have to pull it from the zipper. Because I... I pulled it from the tab and I just pulled the tab off and the zipper was there. So I learned the hard way. So that was the first no-no. And the second no-no was, um, you know, if you stuff her because she could fit a lot. Um, the chaps here do get um, like thinner on the, let me zoom in. They get thinner on the top. As you can see, they're pretty thin on top. So if you stuff her, she gets super thin and thin and thin and then she rips. So that was the second thing that happened to her. She ripped from the chap. So then I was super pissed off. And I told my boyfriend, you know what? We have to take her to Louis Vuitton to the doctor and have her get fixed, you know? And yeah, um, so I got her fixed and let me show you guys the prices and stuff. I'm sorry if you guys just saw my toe. I'm also trying to film this before my boyfriend gets here because I was packing and... So I got two receipts. First, I got this one, which was the total. Let's see if you guys could see that. The total was 540. And this was before, um, before I got her. So this was my like receipt to prove that I left my bag there with them. And then I think I got this one. Or I don't know. It's vice versa or whatever. And then here it tells you what they did to her. Well, let me zoom in. As you could see. The date when I got her fixed was 2018. And then you could see what they fixed. Change slider. Change all outside leather parts. And it was $540. And I got her fixed. And let's see. The address is on this one. I, it's like two cities over in... Let's see. Palo Alto. <laughs> so that's where I got her fixed. If you guys live in the Bay Area. Go to Louis Vuitton Palo Alto. They do an amazing job. Well, they treat you amazing. Um, so yeah. Let's go right to it. So... This is what they fixed. They fixed her, the tab, of course, that I ripped off. They fixed her chaps. I got a new handle, new chaps. I got new piping. Here, let me fix her because she got a little wrinkly. I got new piping. I got the new Louis Vuitton pipe, pipe tab. As you could see, it's very, very nice. And the thing I did notice is that, um, I hope you guys can see my toe. The thing I did notice was that, um, they took the 25 off on this tab. They didn't put it there. Or it doesn't come with it, I don't know. They didn't charge me for it, so they didn't put it on there. <laughs> so, yeah. So, once you get them, um, repaired. So, yeah, I guess it's a good way when you buy a bag and you want to see if it's repaired, just check underneath. And if it doesn't say 25 or 
the size, then it was repaired. And she got new handles, as you can see the glazing on there is amazing. And one thing I did notice from my previous bag was that the, the hardware was thicker on my previous one. So the, the hardware got thinner for these. I don't know why, but... So yeah, she got all that fixed. I think everything was in the exterior. I want to say that... Yeah, I want to say that the... Maybe... Maybe the inside lining got um, fixed too, but I don't see how they could do that. But maybe it was just very clean. But you guys could probably see how clean she is in there. No stains whatsoever. And I'm sure she got a new zipper and new brass because this one looks pretty nice and clean. It doesn't look like scratched or anything. And yeah, I only take her out when it's a nice sunny day when I know there's no rain. Or no chance of any rain because I am not the person to take her out during rainy days because I know she gets stained. And yeah, they even tell you at Louis Vuitton when you first get a bag that has new Vachetta to not wear lotion. So whenever I wear her, I always, you know, put my lotion on and then I wash my hands and make sure I don't have any lotion. Because she does get stained. As you guys can see, she has light, oh, she has light stains on there. Already because you know, I thought it was already time to wear her out with um, me washing my hands. So she already has a little dark It looks darker on the camera. It's not that dark. Oh, there you go. See, it's not that dark But she has this beautiful honey color coming in I'm sorry you guys my nails are dirty because I was packing and they have like glue resin underneath but Overall, you know $540 is a lot but these bags last a lifetime. You guys will not believe how old this bag is. Let's see, let me zoom into that. So she is, the, the date code on her is 8912. So she was made in 1989, well, December 1989. So she is super, she's older than I am. I'm from 96. So, yeah, that tells you how old this bag is, and for her condition, it's incredible. So these bags do last a lifetime, and you could see she has no cracks whatsoever. And that's one thing, if your bag has cracks, let me unzoom. If your bag has any cracks near the zipper, they will not fix it because they don't want to be, um, you know, like, they don't want a customer to be like, you know what, my bag didn't have cracks, and then after you fixed it, it got all cracked up. So yeah, if your bag has any cracks whatsoever, they will not fix it. So yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching my video. Stay tuned. I have, uh, you know, designer unboxing. I think I have Moschino, Dior, um, Yves Saint Laurent, Louis Vuitton. So yeah, and those will be unboxed in my next video. So stay tuned. Thanks for watching. Um, let me know what you guys think of my vintage bag. And I believe I purchased her for $400. Like $380 plus tax and shipping fees. So it was like $400. And I paid $540 for the, to fix it. And it's been a couple years. I got her for my 21st. And yeah, I've been having her for a couple years now. The only thing I've noticed from her is that when I take her out in the sun, you know, she's gotten a little pale on this side. Right here, as you guys could see, a little fading. She rubs on me, so. But yeah, other than that, she is doing amazing. And yeah, stay tuned for my other videos. Make sure to like my channel, subscribe, and yeah. See you guys soon.